guest plays uh, Ellen Warren on the Emmy-laden series 30-something. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to this program, Polly Draper. Hi. Nice to see you. How are you? Nice you look you. terrific. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> How are you? Been backstage with I know. the we bull. Backstage with the bull. Yeah. That's a very impressive animal, wasn't it? Uh, yes, he had an accident. Um, oh, really? <laughs> so what, very I wonder what kind. <laughs> yeah. uh, they now, were saying they hoped it wouldn't, that I wouldn't do the same thing, actually. Do you have a history of that sort of thing? <laughs> no. Contact June Allison immediately. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, but you're not, you're not from the country, so you probably don't spend much time around animals, do you? <laughs> I am. I am from this country. <laughs> I know you're from. Believe the, it or not. I know you're from this country, but I mean, you're from. Oh, the country. Yeah. 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 yeah no, I'm from here. Do you actually. have Do you have pets? Do you like animals? I do you have. Do have two, I have two dogs. Yeah. What kind I are know. they? I've had other do animals too. Mm -hmm. What other animals did you have? I had a um, alligator one time. Really? Yeah. <laughs> why, why would you have an alligator? My grandfather sent him to me. He from just, probably lived in Florida. He did. Yeah. yeah and sent this little box with this alligator in it it was about this big and, uh -huh. and how long did you have it not long it was a terrible thing mm -hmm. it wouldn't eat i did like keep sticking and, yeah. and i put it in my closet where it was the i controlled the temperature hoping it would turn into Every shoes <laughs> <laughs> no but i opened i'd open the door and it would go <laughs> like that oh man that's, that's like that et thing did you yeah. ever see et yeah same kind of deal uh and much. then how how big did it get before it finally went away not much bigger because as i said it didn't eat anything so. yeah um <laughs> well the, is it fun for you to be back in new york city you're from yeah, here originally? i was here actually last week mm -hmm. um i left a sweater here so i'm glad <laughs> so you came right back but, yes okay. i came right back to, i appreciate to get that. it and yeah. Show. Yeah. but um um yeah i um got invited to this dinner party last week that I went to that had some real famous, important diplomats wow. at it. Yeah, so it was pretty impressive. Yeah. I, I sat next to this guy who is a some foreign ambassador or something. Uh -huh. Very, very distinguished guy. <laughs> I can't remember what you country remember what, he's from. You don't know. But, okay. but a foreign one. Mm -hmm. And um, <laughs> and his wife was sitting across the table from a very d distinguished looking woman. And so um, I'm chatting with him very sort of actually it was it aired maybe on the dull side our conversation well, yeah. but then he just sort of looks me in the eyes and says do you like sex and oh man i, mean, I was a little man, surprised yeah, yeah. <laughs> but i thought you know well he's foreign and foreigners probably are more comfortable yeah, maybe so. Sure. so i just sort of said well yeah sure <laughs> 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 and um and so then he kind of said uh-huh you know my wife likes sex too and i said well, i'm really happy for you you know yeah. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. he said yes every time we come to new york she has to go shopping at six <laughs> uh, meaning he just, i swear to god that happened sax fifth avenue is what Sachs he meant yeah that's yeah. what he meant okay all right polly it's time for you to give me the gum come on let me have the gum <laughs> If, if I were to that. ever appear on your show, <laughs> you not would. that there's a chance of that ever happening, but if I were ever to oh, appear, thanks. I wouldn't I wouldn't have gum. I, yeah. I believe you. I'm so sorry. Uh, no one told me to spit it out backstage. <laughs> I forget. Uh, how do you like L.A. now? Do you, do you enjoy living there? I do. Have a big, huge house? No, a, little. Tiny house? house? Yeah. yeah. Two kind of wild dogs that mm -hmm. been around it. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I, I, I got my car stolen there, actually, really? recently. Just off the street, somebody swiped your car? Yeah, well, I sort of left the keys in it. But. <laughs> well, then you, uh, you get an assist. Yes, yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you're scoring at home. Um, but I got it back. You did get it, it back. Not, That's it very back. unusual, I think. Yeah, a week later, mm -hmm. I got it back. No, maybe a little more than a week later. So the guy had parked it in a tow zone, so they just took it away from him. But it was better than I'd left it. He, really? Yeah. He'd, like, gotten a little thing for my tapes, a little thing to a put little my box, tapes. A little box, a little organ, yeah. And he, it was full of gas, and it, there's, like, a little furry thing around the steering wheel. I swear. Oh, yeah. So it was a, kind of a good deal. Yeah, it does sound better. <laughs> well, how, long, how long were you missing your car? 
Uh, maybe a couple weeks, week yeah. and a half. Yeah, were yeah. you just beside yourself? I mean, that's a real um, violation, haven't Yeah, it was kind of too bad. Yeah. I, I felt sad about it, yeah. obviously. Um, and I had a... What kind a, of car was it? A Honda. Yeah. Nice car, new car. It was yeah. a nice. Well, not. New. You're you're lucky to get it back. Now, how how was the, how was the show? How are things going there? This is your third year. Yeah. Third and the show's year. never been more successful, more never popular. More successful. You're winning all of these awards and yeah. stuff. Yeah. And there's a um la last week or this past Tuesday there was an episode on about a gay romance that they've mm. been getting huge complaints about. Oh, is that right? Yeah. A lot of a, negative reactions. A lot of negative reactions. Does, does the negative reaction come from gay people? Well, I guess you might not know that. I don't know. You? Just no, I don't think so. Yeah. I think it's a lot of people just phoning in. Yeah. And what was yeah. your feeling of it? Do you think that it was okay. handled pretty well? I thought it was handled. Yeah. Yeah. And, and your character, you're kind of slowly uh, coming apart. Is that what your character well, is? Well, <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah. No, not slowly. Really yeah. fast. Yeah. <laughs> they, <laughs> they can't stop making me have problems. Is there any hope for you? Not too much, really? I'm afraid. Well, um, this year they're having me sort of have an affair with the married guy. Oh, see, well, now Last that's... year it was an ulcer. And I used to, when I... <laughs> well, which, I don't know. I like the affair with the married guy a little yeah. slightly better. The, um, I would be sitting at restaurants and people would come up to me and say, you shouldn't be eating that spicy food. Well, your, sure, yeah. tell them to mind their own business. <laughs> uh, we got to do a commercial. We'll be right back here with uh, Polly Draper. <laughs> Huh? Is we? We're out of time. Nice meeting you. You're certainly a lovely woman. Please come back Thank anytime you. and continue success with the uh, television show. There. Thank you. 30 something. Wednesdays, is it? Tuesdays. Tuesdays on ABC. Tuesday. <laughs> uh, my thanks also to uh, Jack Hanna and uh, George Carlin. Tomorrow, kids, it's uh, Kelly Lynch and uh, Ed Begley Jr. Go to bed now. <laughs>